Hi guys, and welcome back to another cello lesson. I'm Justin Leppard with Consortina.com, and today I want to talk about something that you may have noticed. It's something that I already use, and it's the fact that there appears to be no peg for my C string. So ordinarily on a cello, all of the pegs do look the same. This was my original peg, and it matches the rest of them you can see. Um, and one of, the, one of the problems that one can have when playing cello is dealing with that peg. Um, when you have the peg, in, it's uh, putting some amount of pressure into your neck. So typically, uh, you know, people will either have a, a poor sort of posture where it's too high, or they are leaning the cello so far away from them that it's kind of like you're viewing the cello at an angle instead of directly on. So the solution to this is the posture peg. And here's the way it looks, is basically it's, it's been a bit deconstructed where there's a hole and a key fits into that hole and basically creates the peg. So you use the key in order to actually turn it, but then you can take it out and then you'll notice that it's much more comfortable. I'm able to put my head right next to the scroll. Uh, this peg, sometimes people do both of them, but this peg just sits for me like right behind my neck and I'm able to look straight down at the cello as I'm playing. So this allows me a greater feeling of connection to the instrument. Um, I think a little bit more accuracy because you're seeing more what's going on. We think so much already in terms of the fingerboard being kind of like a grid that you can imagine. So it doesn't make sense to make that harder by viewing it from an angle. So I personally have found this to be a very useful device. They're not crazy expensive. They're like, 70 or 80 dollars. The one that I have comes from Linda West, cellos in Santa Barbara, and this, this, uh, the String Vision brand. And the only thing about it is that you have to get a luthier to install it. Most, anytime you get a peg or a bridge, they come oversized because you can always take away material, but they're not gonna fit right away. But once you get it fit into your hole, it's ready to go. So this is just something to know about, uh, especially if you're really getting into cello and you're really practicing and you're noticing that you're a little bit disconnected from the strings, there's a solution out there and this video hopefully presents that solution to you and maybe teaches you some things about how you can conceive of posture even with a normal peg setup, just knowing that there is this thing to overcome and if you can find a balanced way to overcome it, even without the posture peg, it's going to make your playing better and your experience of learning cello better and hopefully you just have a better experience overall. So thank you for watching this video. I hope you watch all our videos and all our lessons. We're here to help you learn cello. So leave your questions and comments down below. Once again, my name is Justin Leppard and this has been a production with ConcertAnity.com. We hope to see you guys next time. Mm -hmm.